Can Whiteside turn? Olsen again, was he pushed? No, a goal! A goal for Manchester United. Two men in the penalty area inside Gibson. If he can nick it back now, there must be trouble. Oh, it's gone right across the line. It's in now, though. Well, it's Jesper Olsen who scores. And maybe another chance here for United. It's down the middle, goes Gibson. Tripped, penalty. So Jesper Olsen, who scored a penalty in the match here against Nottingham Forest, United's last league game here, steps up to try and get his second of the night and United's third. Left-footed, it's so easy. 24 hours later, Ron Atkinson was back at Old Trafford with his two new signings. John Sieverbeck just arrived from Copenhagen, and Terry Gibson signed this week from Coventry City. With Gibson beginning his quest for goals in a Manchester United shirt against Sheffield United reserves. In the first half, he was given little opportunity to show the sharpness around goal, but always stood out, even in a struggling side at Coventry. But in the second half, there were encouraging signs of an understanding with Mark Hughes, who was seeking match practice after a two-game suspension. And the one chance Gibson had on Thursday night, he took in typical fashion. Opportunism that gives Ron Atkinson an extra ingredient as he seeks the right recipe to continue United's championship challenge. Sieverbeck, the Danish international defender, also settled in smoothly, even though his last competitive game was two and a half months ago. By now, the United pairing up front were sharpening their act, with Terry Gibson and Mark Hughes staking their claims to play at West Ham on Sunday in front of a much wider audience on the big match live. Oh, yeah, I've, you know, I've ten thought about it a little bit, but not too much. But if I was able to be playing, it would be great. But if not, you know, I'm not too particularly worried at the, at the moment, really. I've got to be patient, and if I do get my chance sooner or later, then hopefully take it. Have you got a good record at West Ham? Never scored against West Ham, <laughs> so <laughs> not one of my favourite clubs. You've got a good record in London, haven't you? Yes, but uh, never ever won at West Ham. Um, neither here as a manager, so that's... Uh, we know how difficult it'll be. Um, they're a particularly good side on their own ground, and uh, they've had a smashing season. Um, it's going to be very difficult, but... I don't know whether it's Robbo coming back or what, but there's somehow or other there seems to be a new buzz about this place again, you know. Disney, we... and has been for uh, the last couple of years. Um, I don't think it's any secret that we, we could finish up next season without one of our uh, front players. Um, so what we're trying to do, really, is get our insurance before it happens. In other words, that's why I've signed Terry, that's why I've signed uh, Peter Davenport. I think a lot of people around the country who love Manchester United but want me to ask you, what has happened to Mark Hughes? I think a lot of the conjecture... Maybe, you know, I've heard it said that, um, like, going out the World Cup with Wales may have had an effect. The transfer speculation may have had an effect. He may just genuinely be going through his first lean trough um, since he came into the game. And he's not been in the game long, you've got to remember that. See, the funny thing with Spark is, you know, he scores great goals. Um, he doesn't get many tap-ins. Now, last week against uh, West Ham, there was just one instance where you thought, go on, that's your chance. And it didn't quite happen for it. Um, Parks, did well against him there. And uh, that might have been the turning point for him. And Stapleton's up ahead of him. Gibson's gone past Gale. Stapleton's in space on the far side. Oh, a tremendous save by Parks. And one by Olsen. A lot of people are writing us off. A lot of people, I might add, that the same people that said it was won by the end of August. Um, so that can work in our favour. We've got a lot of work to do. We've, we've got to start at uh, Queen's Park Rangers today um, and get a result here. Um, 12 games. 